Oh, because I haven't taken damage yet. Well, that's nice. It's not amazing, but it's nice. That's going to be like the only time I open that up. But still, nice little, nice little bonus room. Punching this guy in the gibbs. I want to. Oh, why did I? Unfortunately, I lack the range to go after these guys. Wow, this is going miserably for me. Well, it's okay. Not every, not every run can end in a W. If I expected that, I'd be somebody else. Or a very angry person. Come on. There we go. That's the stuff. That's what I was looking for. But yeah, maybe when I'm a better player, I can I can give the guitar another ro roll and see if it actually gives me what I need. So what's the gum do? The more pets I have, the more jumps I get. Which actually sounds like it would be kind of great. Like, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing that in action. It's going to take a little bit for me to remember that it works. Because uh, I'm just used to having no jumps in this game. Also is mildly predicated on how many jumps I have, but still. Well, let's see, what the clown thing do on the last run? Not the most useful stuff, it just fired a mouse. That would run along the ground. Which, like, certain runs I think that would be fine, but that run I desperately need something with a little bit more uh, air control. I might actually have to switch the controller for this. I've been playing a lot of keyboard and mouse games lately and not a whole lot of... Why did I do this? In this situation, it's worth it. Had I been paying attention, would have blown... Oh, that's the risk. And the rub. I get it. I understand. I blow that up. I don't know if going up there was actually worth... The no yeah, no no I got another I got another grenade for it so it's not so bad. Yep, so now I got one jump. Yeah, I, I really wish that with, with the metal guys, what it would do is instead of um instead of making them full and vulnerable, it just made it so that they uh you really had to shoot them to get through their armor. Or you could just have better timing. All right, secret room. That is... 15 coins for an item if I can actually do it. But I'm gonna be honest with you. I freaking suck at those. Like, I was watching Alexa just roll through them like nothing. Not gonna lie, bit jealous. I don't think I... I, I think I just don't have that, like, level of fine control anymore. I do in certain games, and I definitely do with a controller. Unless, of course, it lets me use my pets. Maybe we should try that. I'll think about it. But I, I think those mini games are straight up uncheesable, and that's a sad. I'll grab Clay Doll. Yeah, do we do we give it a go? I could try it once. Yeah, the problem is I'm just not paying full attention. Yeah, so I can't I can't double jump in here. Well, 
Well, that freaking sucked. I kind of wish it didn't have the black keys. Yeah, like I said, I'm not very good at that one. I probably won't be. Let's double check. I haven't been down this. Oh, right. Hail Mary. Nope. Didn't work. Yeah, the tiles are just, I think, a little too thin for me. Uh, and, like, maybe I could make it work. Gosh, that was a lot of money wasted. Like, I could probably make it work with enough practice. And maybe I should. But it's just, like, I don't know. I came to this game to play a roguelike about shooting and fighting stuff. Uh, not to test my ability to hit fine targets while platforming. If I want to do that, I go play Mario. Brave cookies. Add shields and heart container. That's eh, good. It's good. Uh, let's go back for a second. I want to say there's a crystal chest that I left behind, but I probably didn't. That sounds like an accessibility option. I would like that. Uh, oh, yeah, no. I'm a huge proponent of accessibility options in video games as somebody that just, like, either sucks or just doesn't care about certain mechanics, and it's... Ah! There we go. I knew I left one of these bad boys behind. I don't actually know if this is... Yeah, it's kind of worth it. Definitely got me some deal with the devil tendency, which is good. Uh... But it's just like, I I am not here to play that game. And so it would be kind of lovely if I could just either turn it off or make the keys bigger. Uh. And I understand for like some people, oh, but that ruins the challenge of it. The answer is you're completely correct. Grab me some nougat, which gets me nonstop keys. That's good stuff. Uh, let's see. But yeah, I, I'm just not here for that kind of mechanics, nor am I terribly interested in them, and because they're different from, like, what the game normally is conventionally, it's one of those where it's like, yeah, but what if it, what if I just didn't, if this game didn't have that? I've done in a number of games. Uh, what's a good example? Any game that has, like, a weird mini-game that you have to complete, just to finish it or, like, get 100% always feels real bad to me. Uh, kind of Final Fantasy has done that in the past. Uh, I was actually a little grumpy in Final Fantasy VII. They had the darts. And I enjoy, I enjoy the darts. They were, it was fine. But it was definitely one of those where it's like, yeah. Is that worth it? Nah, that ain't worth it. Let's see. But like, I liked the idea of the darts, but it was kind of a letdown that it's like, hey, if you do this kind of actually hard mini game, that's how you get this really rare thing super early. And I'm like, yeah, but what if, what if you just had like an easy version for people that aren't good so they don't have to spend like two hours playing this mini game? And I get it. Like, you just, you don't have to do it, it's optional. But that just sucks. This is me griping as a person that doesn't want to try hard. I think is the main thing. Yeah, Blitzball. Ooh, Blitzball. Blitzball, Blitzball in Final Fantasy X is actually probably the best example. You are correct on that one. Like, the card games in the previous games were good and probably very important, but at least there was... Those were quick and kind of enjoyable. Whereas Blitzball, like, you could cheese it, and you could absolutely, like, cheat and do, like, a bunch of other things that made it really good. But, like, I don't wanna. Let's see, wait, was there something we could have gotten if you got first place in darts? Would have tried a bit more if I known. Yep, it would get you the luck up materia, which, like, realistically, not the biggest thing. But it's nice. Mutated Orange or Secrets Forever. I think Like of the King just makes me faster. I'm gonna go Pickaxe. We're still early enough in the run that this is actually useful.
And like, I can totally understand why people would like Blitzball, but for the people that didn't like Blitzball, uh, which I definitely belong to that camp, it was one of those where it definitely dragged down my enjoyment of Final Fantasy X when I went back and like hundoed the game because it's just like, yeah, but this just sucks. I have that I have that problem with a couple of games where it's just like, yep, and here's the one thing that's required for progress, and I'm like, oh, I don't, I don't. Uh. Okay, let's grab the coins. Let's grab this. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. It was even worse in the sequel to some small degree. Damn it. I jumped, but I must have, like, bonked my head or something. I'm just taking crazy damage. I love wings, but it absolutely screws me over more often than I care to admit. Let's see. Let's actually go in here. Not that it really helps too much, but we have a ton of crystals sitting around somewhere. Well, last time pink was good for me. I hate this room. Let's see. Nope. Can't get that. Playing a girl, you have to go with pink. That's... If that's actually a thing, I'm going to be mad. And if that's just you saying it, then don't. Because that kind of generalization is kind of stupid. I'm a dude that really likes pink. And I know a lot of girls that don't like pink in the slightest. Now, now I'm always just gonna pick, pick blue, with the chick. Ooh, that one's a little quicker. I'm mostly dodging purely based on like instinct and minor muscle memory. Plus side, I've got stupid jumps, so I can just go over this one. I'm glad you were joking, though. I was going to be kind of upset if that's actually something the developers had included. Go board. Adds extra pulls per shot and increases your movement speed. Hey, I like that. That's a good, that's a good step in, in terms of just, like, raw damage. Okay, yeah, let's go in here. Let's not stab it this time. Blue used to be a softer, more feminine color. Pink and red was more masculine and harsher. Pigment rare, so it was reserved for warriors. Yep. Same thing got with how men originally were the ones that wore skirts, specifically. I mean, I think women, for the most part, wore, like, full body wraps-ish. Uh... What? Oh, he spawned in. I didn't even notice him in the room. That's the heels for for were for men originally too. Wow. I'm not doing a good job with my angel room tendency today. At least not this run. This this run definitely is not holding its own nearly as much. We're doing okay. But I'm not I'm not feeling it. Ow, what? Oh. Shot from the grave. I killed him and I stopped paying attention. Okay, we actually want to go down here. Pop this, and actually try and angel room this. Freaking tough. Okay, 
Get the laser bear. And get that guy. Get the wild monkey. They're getting plenty of keys, which is good. Antlers. I don't know what these do. Drop extra coins when you use keys. Hey, That's nice. Kind of wish I had that a little bit more. Okay. Kill them. Okay, avoid that. We still have the Teleslashers, but I've got enough pets that we're kind of in a happy spot. Oh, we have the Teleslashers. I've barely picked up any damage upgrades, which is really not helping my case here. Well, at least we get the Seals patch. Upgrade your weapon, increase movement speed. That's okay. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got over here. Uh, let's see. We got an arcade room. I think we might have unlocked something new. Not my thing. What? Oh. Probably worth it. We're going to need more grenades. But at least I don't need them nearly as bad as some of the other some of the other upgrades or keys. You need keys more 90% of the time. Okay, you did. Ah, that gets me a grenade back. And yeah, I want to I want to use my keys as much as possible. Gives me cashola. Getting a lot of crystals. Not much I can use them on though. Yet. Uh, let's see. Go shopping. I don't think I'm gonna bother with the arcade room. I could get the trumpet, but I think I'm gonna pick Matchbox up. Don't know if Matchbox is a good idea. Well, round two against this guy, but I can actually hit him this time. Yeah, look at that. I'm actually, you know, capable of hitting this guy. Because he, he's definitely one of the bosses that hangs out just on the ceiling. Uh, let's see. So I'll, I'll stay away from the matchbox, I think, in the future. Nope. Could potentially bonk an egg into that, but... Stay away from them for a bit. We got a shooty bear up there. So that's fine. There we go. Adam three. Angel tendency is slightly slowly going up. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately like this, I'm going to run out of a whole bunch of eggs. Oh yeah, let's see what the mutated orange does. Super strong movement speed and weapon damage. Okay, so mutated orange was is actually worth something. I... Let's see. Nope, I do have a grenade for this one.
Get it before they wreck it. Alright, so we've got Angel Room Tendency. Push him back. Alright, we get Wade Tech. Upgrades the weapon, increases rate of fire. I'd like to get a new gun. We'll see what we get. Alright, I have never seen Acorn or the Magical Bean. Uh, let's go for the bean. Recover all your hearts and increase your weapon range. The range is nice, the extra hearts is let down. But I look kind of neat. Oh, is that a DBZ reference? It's a Senzu. It's a Senzu bean, I got it. Slayer demons, kill enough enemies, you get crystals. Unfortunately, I'm not really using crystals that much on this run. Okay, sack that, get some other things. Keep, hello. It's kind of nice. Just have to be very careful with my eggs. this open. Well, careful with my eggs, but they're blowing everything up. I, realistically, I guess it's fine. We'll just lose a lot of mobility later on. Maybe, maybe that's not terrible. Grab that. What? I have most definitely taken damage. Damn it. Did that just wreck? Yeah, that didn't help, help too much at all. Hell yeah, cash. Go in here. Putting me a good spot. Let's grab the golden apple. Upgrade your weapon, increase your movement slightly. Grab that. Avoid touching egg to rock. Because I'd like some of them to hatch. McFamily again. Already? Okay, sure. Well, I actually do decent decent chunk of, chunks of damage here. So that puts me in a somewhat okay position. Really avoiding their damage is less than pleasant. That's well, okay. Get broccoli, adds a heart container. I'm going to be beef chonky. Haven't seen the towel go by. Probably not going to see the towel go by on this run. It'd be lovely to get it more often than not. But oh well. Immediately plunk our way into the shop. Shop has. It's like a scope. Still don't think I've tried the trumpet yet. Maybe I did it once. Okay, I'm gonna leave this guy here. We might go for a deal with the devil, but... I'm not betting on it. Okay, grab that. Check this out. Grab some of these. 
Now I have a shit ton of eggs. I've got to be very careful when going over this one. Okay. Well, the nice part is I do a decent chunk of damage, so I should be able to just, like, punch my way through a lot of these guys. Okay, got him. The poor eggs. Okay, so far so good. Hatching failed. Back down. Angel room tendency is looking real good. Speaking of looking real good. That gets it? No, it doesn't. Dang. Get a bad apple. All my bullets do poison damage now. I'm fine with this. Betting on blue. Blue was the correct choice. At least this time around. Bottom one would have been an egg vending machine, though, so I, that might have been just as good. Grab that. Crystal, there's our... There's a uh, angel deal. What do you know? There's the towel. All right, this run's got legs. Wonder what... Flavor it is. Hey, thank you, Mini Murgle, for the. Ow. How did I take damage? What hurt me? I have no idea, but thank you for the five gifted subs. I was too distracted. What the hell is this? Whoa, okay. Okay, are they done? Yeah, okay, they, they will chill. Just takes a little bit. Panicking. I like the introduction of new mechanics. That's a nice system. Oh, I got a moldy heart. That's what it was. Okay, avoid that. Get a jack too. Get an egg. Really, a whole lot of point in going up there. I'm probably gonna lose some eggs in this process, but that's fine. All right, so what are we looking at? Let's go back down here, hit up the shop. Telescopic sight, increase your weapons range, and your jump height. Not a huge jump height upgrade, to be honest. Not enough to really justify it. Gosh, these guys got eggy. That's my job. I could do that. We're getting a decent chunk of grenades too, so I'm feeling I'm feeling high and dry here. Uh let's see. Did I do I have anything else? Okay. Shark. Okay, I can use the eggs as bombs when I don't have any bombs. That's actually not great for me. I mean, it's kind of good. I kind of need my eggs. Oh, uh, that sucks. Hi, what? Price. 
figured I'd hang out in a corner because that'd be safe, right? Nope. Hang out, hide, grab the pain drop. Weapon damage, rate of fire. I can't believe how good the generic weapon is in this game. I guess actually, it's a little bit of a shock. Because normally when I play these games, the generic starting weapon is trashed here and you want to get rid of it as soon as possible. But like, it ain't bad. You obviously have to get upgrades for it. You can't just like go on your own. But it ain't bad. Got those. Killed by grenades from me. Mixed feelings on that one. We've got a bunch. Or he just pieced out. Maybe I blew him up. Possible. I don't know. Alright, get more egg. Oh! What? Oh, what the hell? Alright, that was a thing. Yeah, it was worth it. Yeah, so we're probably going to lose a lot of my mobility very quickly here. Not the keenest on that situation. Come on, reveal yourself so you may die! Get rid of the bear. Alright, he dead? He dead. Okay, so you can poison the little android dudes. And dudes. Dude droids. Grab the rest of those. Dang it. He is sniping those. No, damn it. I'm stuck in this little corner. Well. There goes Bromp. I got cash. Yeah, the problem is, uh, the less of these pets that I have, the less jumps I have. I kind of need those for mobility. I'll live without them, but they're nice. Yeah, so I can't I can't poison them until they're vulnerable, but once they're vulnerable, they're poisoned and they will keep taking damage. Okay. What is this compared to Isaac Nuclear Throne Gungeon? I like it more than Gungeon and nuclear throne, but I think a lot of that comes down to the fact that I'm not that great. Like, I'm kind of bad at dodging in Gungeon, and nuclear throne just... Makes me want to die, but I also just die, die. But I would say it's kind of in the same tier. It's definitely less polished. There's there's some seriously rough edges in this one compared to uh, most other roguelikes in the same category. But there's also a lot more potential, I think. This game does the uh, wild, crazy synergy route that, like... Your run snowballs into something fascinating by the end. Uh. 
I hate the fact that that's the melee button as well. It makes no goddamn sense. Well. And there are definitely some ch design choices that, like, need to be fixed. But, it's a fun game. And, seriously, it is, you're way too likely to just shank something you don't want to shank. Should probably hop on their Discord and be like, please change this. Anyway, yeah, they're truly like the only the only two big issues with this game is that enemies can sometimes spawn on top of you and you take damage. And then yeah, you just shank shit that you don't want to. But otherwise, like, it's super good. And I've had way more memorable runs with this than I have with most other roguelikes. You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna own it. It really wants me to go down the deal with the devil route, so I guess I'm just gonna have to eat the dang bitch. Oh, underestimate your desire to shank. It's seriously. Yeah. There's also like a little bit of political humor that I don't like. Uh, I think a lot of that comes down to the fact that for me, uh, it's not a joke, but for the rest of the world, it kind of is. And it's like, ah. Yeah, you got the grabber in the demo. And it's like, I get it. I get why it's there, and I get why they included it. But it just... It doesn't make me feel good. What was he talking about? They got... Uh, they got Trump as a character that you can... Character? It's one of the, like, egg baby things that follows you around. Black Raven. Raven. I think that's actually straight up worse than the seagull. Yeah, the pet system can also give you pets that sabotage your run. Yeah. Let's try this thing. Let's see if it's any good. Okay, no, it does a shit ton of damage. Grab that. Grab the bodyguard glasses. We're doing okay. Let's see, demo seemed easier than Gungeon Throne 2, would you agree? Yeah. Oh, 100%. This is this is a lot easier. Like like I was talking about earlier with the whole Isaac thing. Uh, yeah, screw it. I'm just going to get it over with. Uh, let's see. Let's see if we got Devil Wings. If we got Devil Wings, I will be happy. No. I want to say Mercenary Lord is good. That one's a good one. There's the, there's the rest of the level. I'd say, I imagine it gets harder as you unlock additional managers. I've actually beaten all of the managers. Uh, it actually gets harder based on how many runs you do. Uh, the more tokens you, you pay in, the better. Night Vision or Agent Watch? I think Agent Watch is good. So, more keys I have, the more damage I'm going to do. Yeah, some money's power. Okay, I'm digging this laser thing. It does, it does dang bitch in a very good way. Oh, did I leave a coin behind? Let's see, have I been playing on normal or hard? I started on easy, um, but beat the last manager, Athena, on hard. Or not hard, on easy. Or normal, gosh, there's three difficulties and I, it took three tries. I'm not paying attention. Uh, I started on easy, uh, which seems to just decrease the, uh, it just seems to decrease boss health. Hey! Welcome, Retro and Associated Raiders. How you guys doing tonight? Ow! 
And I guess I kind of know how Rita's day's been going, uh, considering I was part of it. Uh, how were his, how were his uh, Neon Abyss runs? Did he do good? Did he do big numbers? Very busted. OP final run. What uh? What manager is he up to? At around 11 babies. Damn. This should be a run where I'm collecting babies as I have like very specific benefits. Uh, let's see. Do I... I've already done the deal with the devil. Do I... Yeah, screw it. Let's check the shop. I'm just gonna devil it up. Man, that's garbage. Don't care. That's the only second different save file for Twitch. I... I respect your guys' desire to go through this game twice for both uh, YouTube and Twitch, but gosh, I could not do that. I've actually already hacked it, so I have a shit ton of tokens, so I can actually start using all of the items in the game instead of um, spending forever grinding for both, but cripes. Let's see, that's a lot of money. Did you kill Grammar? Yup. Kill Grammar, uh, Grammar, Grabber. I killed Grabber, and I've got money as power, so... Okay, good. That popped out. I need the shields as I'm squandering it hard. We're dealing with the devil a little bit more than I want. Hacks. Oh, 100%. I... I I do not play games to grind anymore. That... That was... That was the old Wanderbot. The new one is like, give me all the cool toys. Let me add it, add it sooner than later. Because, like... I was unlocking maybe one item per run, and that was starting to become a problem. Especially because there's like six pages of items to unlock in. Ha! Ah, I just I can't do that. Now we need some more of those sweet gun upgrades. Yeah, I really want uh, more multi-shot here. I got places to be and things to obliterate. See? You got it. Yeah, I used to do I used to do the grind to unlock thing, but I think after Isaac I just burnt out on it and everything after that point has just been like, eh, just give me everything. It's fine. And Rita's runs he got five double jumps. I think I got I think I got five right now. It's a bit variable, it's based on how many pets I've got. And he's gone. That guy absolutely should not pop up until after the room is over. Because, yeah, half the time I trigger those guys, they're just like, and we're gone. It's like, oh, come on, smithing hammer. Hey. I think I just get big lasers. Nothing more. That's fine. Nope, didn't get anything cool. Fine. Uh, Missing anything else? No. Shop had boring. Boss time. Zeus? No. Hal. I need two can two can spawn set eggs. What? Wow, I do a lot of damage. Right, I <laughs> I'm apparently incredibly strong. Uh yeah, cool. That's easy. I also found there's a max shield cap. Yup, been there. So, I think we're, yeah, we're on track for fighting Ares. I guess we'll fight Ares. But then after that, I really should go with the, uh, deals with Athena. I wonder if you can actually get more. Trade one of these, see what you got. Did you just, oh, he gave me an egg. I, right. come on, baby, give me some wings. Nope. Bonsai is good. Or Flower Pot is good. I think? No, I don't actually know. Well, we'll get the Ares token and then hope to gob we get 
Uh, we give me some angel rooms that actually are worth something. goes. Life is good. We're getting a surprising amount of grenades. I was not expecting this much. Uh, let's see. Do I... Well. Rest in egg, egg. But as long as I've got the orbitals, I got three jumps. That's really all I need. This is enough to get over a boss if I need to, or get around a room. Especially with this damage. I think we can... Wait, can I shoot through walls with this one? No. That's just certain weapons. Tiny mummy, too. Oh, there's a key. Go back for it. Okay, got it. We're on, on Angel Room Tendency. out. There we go. My Aries token died. Oh, really? Well, that's an interesting new one. So you can't do both. Well, we might not fight Aries here. I think. I don't really know if there's a way of salvaging that one. More pets you have, the more bullets you fire. Whoa! Yes! I mean, obviously, that's a bit of a letdown as I'm squandering pets left and right here. Enemies might have shot it up. Interesting. Well, one way or another, I'll make it work. Yeah, so it got destroyed by rocks. That feels like a design oversight. It must count as an egg. I... One way or another, uh... One way or another, that thing should not be destroyable. That's like if you could just randomly lose the Polaroid. In Isaac. Like, super not acceptable. One way or another, I know to avoid picking up the matchbox just in the future, in general. It's kind of trash to begin with. Dark side. Not actually very good. Uh, let's grab a shield at the very least. Maybe you're supposed to defend the token, like dangling around all your other mortal orbitals and babies. <sighs> if this game was better for it for that sort of thing i think i'd agree but if that's the case and it's actually you're supposed to defend it then that's kind of dumb because as it stands my orbitals are incredibly hard to defend <laughs> like you just don't have the gameplay options for it so you mostly just have to like screw yourself over just to keep them alive i guess i mean one way or another i'm a beast machine here i'm just not going to be able to fight Aries this time around. Or maybe I am? Hey, I guess it worked. I guess you just don't need the token. Cool. Well, let's see if I can get a uh, Athena. Yeah. 
Damn it. down to one orbital. Oh, and it doesn't count. I feel slow. You never pick up Matchbox, by the way. It is pure trash here. Is like definitive, it is definitively not worth. That is one. Increase the rate of fire if you get hurt while in this room. I mean, that's good. Somewhat good. You're shopping. What? No! What? Ah. Uh. How? God damn it. So. There goes my Athena tendency because for some reason the door turns into a devil door on the way up. I have questions, conundrums, and grumps. I'm doing, I'm fine. I will be fine. I just... His run is strong in spite of many things. Well, it's fine. Yep, that resets my wisdom tendency. Oh, well, maybe we'll get lucky and get some more. I'm gonna blow myself up. Because I got the towel. I got plenty of HP, and Ares himself is not very hard, considering how much damage I'm currently able of putting out. Even with... Single laser. Gosh, I keep clicking out of the window. Because, yeah, it doesn't lock your cursor to the window. And I've got way too many monitors. Nah. I don't think I'm going to be able to get more, more than this. Shame. This run had the potential to be so much more. We're probably still going to win, but I can't help but feel slightly let down. Well, let's hope that egg doesn't just blow itself to kingdom come and we can actually use it for something. There we go. Alright, we're getting a couple of eggs. Don't blow up on the rocks. Okay. Sad part is... I can't actually get back up without blowing up some of my eggs. So I'm just gonna warp out over here. Feel cheated, is that how you feel? Oh yeah, 100%. I'm doing, I'm doing fine. But I could have been doing better. Whoops. Well, no, we managed, we managed that one. Oh, whoops, I just blocked, well, yeah. I think that might have been the end anyway. Sup, Ares?
I mean, it straight up doesn't matter. I am just damage central. Bye. You know what the Athena wouldn't show up? Well, it's because I never got the Athena token anyway. Alright, uh, let's see. So what do we unlock? We got the beginning Nico. What do we got down here? Because this will get us R6. Anything else that really strikes my fancy? Nah, let's go. Let's go here. Let's go with... What are some other upgrades I want to grab? 